Hello everyone, I'm Tanishtha Bhattacharya. I graduated from Aizabharampur in uh, 2023 and currently I'm a graduate student at Max Planck Institute for Heart and Lung Research in Germany. Uh, Iser has been a wonderful journey for me and overall speaking, it is a interdisciplinary research institute which gives you a uh, opportunity to explore different domains and different areas of science. Hello, my name is Ritika Sethi and I graduated from the Indian Institute of Science Education and Research Barampur in the year 2023. Currently, I'm pursuing my PhD in physics at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology. I'm working on stellar physics and planets outside of our solar system, popularly known as exoplanets. I joined ICERN in 2018 and at that point, I didn't really know where my true passion lied. I was just curious about sciences. And I think ICERN has a wonderful curriculum and environment that nurtures this curiosity. Hi, my name is Rita Bani and I'm currently in my fifth year of the BSMS dual degree program at ICERN Bhopal. I got admitted to the 2019 batch of electrical engineering and uh, computer science through the ICERN aptitude test channel. As of now, I have received a PhD admit from Harvard School of Engineering and Applied Sciences for the fall of 2024. So in general, um, it's a five-year program in which in the first two years, uh, you are mostly taught all the subjects like physics, chemistry, maths, biology, earth and environmental sciences, computer science, um, also economics as well, and communication. And in, from the third year on, you are free to select your own major, which is interest, which interests you the most. And along with that, you can also choose a minor subject if you like. In the fifth year, um, everyone is uh, allowed to do a master thesis project in any research topic that they are interested in. Um, not just in India, but also in abroad, and which gives you a very good perspective of whether you want to do a PhD or graduate studies further down along the line. Truly being a student at ISA Bhopal has been a very humbling and gratifying experience that has shaped me not just as a budding researcher, but as an individual too. Predominantly, I really enjoyed uh, the coursework here because it was innovative considering that professors often incorporated elements from their own research into classroom teaching, um, exemplifying and uh, making the world around us seem very conducive. Uh, for instance, as an ECS major, I had the opportunity to take courses such as microelectromechanical systems, smart sensing technologies and spintronics that involved a very fun uh, evaluation system too. Unlike most other universities and institutes where a student is made to right away choose a specialization, at ICER, we are made to study all the four branches of science for the first two years, that is physics, chemistry, math, and biology. In addition to this, we also take a few uh, additional but important courses like environmental sciences, computer sciences, economics, English, etc. It may sound a little intimidating at first, especially for PCB or PCM students. I myself come from a PCM background and I was a little scared, but believe me, you will get through it because the teachers here, they are so supportive. You can always go with your doubts to their office and they'll help you out. We also have a lot of facilities like the computer lab or the institute library where you can access the course material or read books that are relevant to, to your courses. I really enjoyed the after class discussions or the group projects apart from the pen and paper tests that uh, tested the critical uh, thinking abilities and really helped sharpen my scientific temperament. Uh, projects, assignments and presentations were very fun and very enriching. And it was particularly very interesting to see and understand how a system perhaps as simple as a cantilever could have such a wide-ranging ramifications in the world around us in building uh, large-scale architectures. So that truly was a huge takeaway and um, it really helped me uh, get a different sense of multidisciplinary research uh, to solve real-world problems incorporating multiple constraints. Apart from that, the ecosystem was very conducive uh, at the Institute. We had seminars, talks and conferences on a daily basis 
that helped us uh, come in contact and uh, interact with uh, prominent researchers from different areas from all across the globe. And it was so inspiring to hear their tales of how they got motivated into research. And that has truly propelled me as well to uh, take up a PhD and uh, get into academia in the future. Uh, apart from academics, the institute has also always given oxygen to various and numerous uh, extracurricular activities. Throughout these five years, uh, albeit COVID, I've been a part of multiple clubs and council endeavors such as the debating society, uh, the tennis club, table tennis, um, uh, STEM clubs, etc., uh, science council, which have also helped me interact uh, with school students and propagate the message of science communication. So in a nutshell, I think uh, this institute is truly a perfect amalgamation of science and sustainability with society. And I'm sure anybody who joins it would have a wonderful experience. Thank you so much.